morning, Vital Men. It's good to be with you again on another Monday morning. You know, today, as I was thinking about and praying about what to speak to you about, we've actually been through the five cowboy coats, and we're going to get ready to do another teaching. But before we go there this morning, I got to thinking about what it lives to just go through the motions of living what I call an ordinary life where you're really not deep into the word, you're not praying, you're just kind of existing in the midst of your faith. You know, this morning I stand in front of a church that was built in, in 1883, right after the Civil War. And it's an old Baptist church. Matter of fact, I went here one time with my grandmother a long time ago as a young boy. But now as you can see, this church, even though the building is still here, the doors are locked, it's slowly deteriorating down, and no one comes. I wonder what happened. What's caused that this beautiful church and the, and the people who once came, what happened here? Did life just become ordinary in the midst of their faith and no longer did they hunger? Or what happened? So what happened is, is it's, doors are closed and no one comes. And I think that's what happens to our life sometimes. We get in our everyday ordinary lives and we just exist. We don't have fire for Jesus. We don't, we, don't have, we don't look excited to get into his word. We don't have a prayer life and it's non-existent and the only time we pray is when something goes wrong. I encourage you, vital men, that God has called us to live a life of mission and in the midst of the mission, we have destiny. We don't want to become like this old church. Doors are closed. They're locked and no one comes. We want to be men on fire for Jesus. So men, I'm going to encourage you about this, of living a life of mission that will help you in your destiny. Don't just exist in life, in your faith. Don't just live an ordinary life and have non-existent faith, but be, have a life that is excited and you have a heart on fire for Jesus. Men, I guarantee you about that, when you have that, walk and live in your destiny. Vital men, I can't wait to see you next week. Have a great day and be men who live in destiny and have a heart for Jesus. Have a great day. We'll see you next week.